Gentlemen, this is not a drill. I think that we have infiltrated electronic arts with an MMG stay. For years, electronic arts has boxed me out. They have done everything to spite me. But this year, this season of Madden 24 Wheel of Mud, I am literally prestige god. Limited it, Jamar Chase. Dude, this is out of left field. Nick Bosa, we saw Nick Bosa coming. It was playoffs. Rob Gronkowski, middle linebacker, out of left field. And now, Jamar Chase gets a limited wide receiver in a completely random promo called Weekly wild cards. Now, of course, if you keep up with Wheel of Mutt, you'll know that Jamar Chase was one of my original three prestige players. Now, every time you make a Super Bowl, you get an extra prestige player, but at the start of every season, you get three. My three were Jamar Chase, Nick Bosa, and Derwin James. Derwin James is the final player on this entire team that hasn't gotten an insane updated card. And to be honest, with this weekly wild card promo, I would not be surprised at all if Derwin James also also got one in the same promo. I don't know if Derwin's gonna get the limited. The fact that Jamar Chase got the limited is even crazier because the limiteds are the best in the drop. They're the highest overall. And this Jamar Chase is insane. And since Jamar Chase is a prestige player, that means I am always entitled to the best version and we'll be throwing him on the team today. Here is Jamar compared with his previous edition. The previous edition, Jamar Chase most feared was an excellent card too. He was so good on this team. Now obviously at this point he's outdated, but not anymore. His catch and traffic is is a little bit low, but with gift wrap, that doesn't matter. 97 spectacular catches, insane, and this card is bonkers. And oh my god, as you boys are watching this, today's the Super Bowl, right? I don't know who's gonna win, but I am at the Super Bowl as you're watching this. I'm there. So I'll be making a video. I hope you guys enjoy it. Score prediction, I actually have the Niners winning. I have been a Kansas City Chiefs hater all playoffs, and I guess it's just in my blood, because I'm gonna stick to that. Now, I'm gonna put Jamar Chase at wide receiver three, because wow, this is one of the most insane receiver cores we've ever had in Wheel of Mutt. So Jamar Chase is not as fast as Zay Flowers. He's one speed under Zay Flowers, but he's still, I mean, obviously an absurd card. And he's a lot bigger than Zay Flowers is, much less fumble prone. And then this Jamar Chase gets free matchup nightmare, better route running and catching versus linebackers. I'm putting him at the slot. So there's actually a pretty good chance he will be covered by linebackers every once in a while. So this is going to be a really nice ability to have. No X factors on him. We start off a very, very crucial episode with a huge upgrade. And this is such a crucial episode because our current record is four and two. So this is really the biggest game of our season because winning those four games is literally pointless if I lose right now, because if I lose, this entire team gets reset. That's the scary thing. Still looking to get a little bit better depth behind Gronkowski. We, I do like 90 overall Jake Ferguson, but that could be better. Definitely need help on the offensive line. Willie Rofe, Froholt, Cam Jurgens. These guys are just not going to cut it in the long run. And then defensively, got to get Jalen Graham out of there. Hopefully get an upgrade for Derwin James. Shelby Harris, Aaron Donald are not going to cut it. My corners are finally pretty damn solid. Jalen Ramsey, Darius Slade, Devin Hester is a pretty interesting core, but very cool. All right, boys. Hope you're loving Wheel of Mutt. I hope you're excited for the Super Bowl. My goal right now is to put you guys in an incredible mood before you watch the big game. Let's see if we can pull it off. Our very first wheel spin. I'm looking to add a center or left tackle right here, right now. Hopefully, I'm given the opportunity. Go some Mutt. 90. Do they have a center? If they don't have a center, they'll definitely have a backup middle linebacker, a D tackler, a left end. Unfortunately, they don't have a center, but they do have 90 overall middle linebacker Demario Davis. I get a choice of any of the 90s here. Mario Davis is a really solid middle linebacker. 89 speed, 93 excel, good coverages, 6'2". He probably gets Lurk Artist, but I highly doubt he gets it for free. So we won't be running Lurk Artist on him, but he'll be a good sub in for Jalen Graham right now, who's, who's obviously should not be on this team. All right, first wheel spin. It's a Solid sub in, but it's nothing super impactful. I'm really hoping that we could actually pick up maybe a left tackle, maybe a center here. Dude, I am just stacking the zero chill players, and I absolutely can get somebody. So zero chill jackpot, we can get any player from the zero chill promo. Now, keep in mind, I did cheat this season with Dree Archer. I was never supposed to get Dree Archer. Dree Archer is a ghost of mutt. He is not zero chill. So I am going to play by the rules on this one, since I already fumbled the bag on Dree Archer. So, for example, there's a 93 overall Ryan Kelly, but he's a ghost of mutt. He's not zero chill, so I can't get him. Honestly, I think I've 
to get Trent Williams. We momentarily had this Trent Williams on last season, and I almost prestiged him. I was really close to prestiging Big Trent. And honestly, this is a great pickup since they made the Super Bowl. And you guys are about to watch the Niners in the Super Bowl. So I'm going to go Trent Williams here. He's a stud. So now we got 94 Trent Williams on the left side, 94 John running on the right side. Excellent tackles. All right, huge pickup there, getting 94 overall Trent Williams. Now we go to our third and final wheel spin where maybe he up. All right, so any legend, but it's gotta be on the team. I've never gotten this wheel spin. Maybe we get something we can use here. I don't know. It's gonna depend on the team. We can get any. No way I'd get 49ers again. Yo, they're speaking to us, man. I think, I think Wheel of Mutt knows that the Niners are taking this puppy home. All right, 49ers legends. There's a 93 Vernon Davis. That would low-key be a sick backup to Gronk. And then there's Joe Montana. Yeah, they don't got shit. Ironic. I felt like the 49ers would have had a lot more options in this, but not a lot for the 49ers and not super helpful to this team. Oh, there's also a 92 limited Jerry Rice, but he's not going to move the needle on this team either. I think we're taking Vernon Davis. I'm not going to complain about this. This is a super fast tight end. 94 speed. Uh, not a good run blocker. But he's going to be a lot better than Jake Ferguson. Damn, this team is looking great. We're a 92 overall, and we are 4-2, and two, so it's win or go home. We're doing one of two things today, boys. We're either booking a flight to Cancun, or we're booking a flight to Vegas. That doesn't even really make sense since we're going to the playoffs. Whatever, shut up. You know exactly what I mean. Hines, Ward, Randy, Moss, Herb, Adderley, dude. Those Super Bowl pass players are so nasty. So Hines Ward has unstoppable deep in elite. Huge hit right there. Second and seven. We start out seeing RPO. Damn, these Super Bowl cards are interesting. So he's got, he's going to have deep and elite the whole game. And then Josh Dobbs has immune to defensive pressure on them. These are weird. Another run play. Jalen Carter just barely misses. Definitely forced him inside a little earlier than he wanted to though. He's going to want to throw short here. We could have a huge stop to start this game. Let's get it right now. There's the whip route. It's not open. Big post. No. Dude, so Jesse Bates actually has the KO to knock that out, but the computer Jesse Bates went for the interception, and I couldn't knock it out with Hester. That was a nice completion, but come on, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it. You know you want to. What a fucking ball that is. Oh. I'm not worried. I really am not worried yet. Oh my god, dude, I've gone like 30 straight episodes without forgetting the challenge wheel. I just forgot it. Shit, dude, if the challenge wheels like get a shutout in the first half, I'll be so fucking sad. I literally would have lost it already. Our challenge wheel challenge is... Oh. Our challenge wheel puts us on 40 bomb alert. Score 31 plus points in today's game. Let's see what he's got here on defense. Marcus Peters, Darius Slay, Ray Lewis. Inside stuff. Definitely. Ah, no. I actually made the exact correct decision. That's exactly what I should have done. He does not see the whip route. I think he shaded inside because that was so easy. Here we go. First and 10. Great drive. Let's keep it up. There's Jamar Chase. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. Not sure what he's going for here. Third and 12. There's Dre Archer. That is honestly, that is a hell of a ball. That not easy for them to make that throw. Everything was fucking blanketed. The four-man four rush. Holy shit. See, because even if I get intercepted, though, it's at least, it's still better field position to get intercepted there. So I definitely played that wrong. Yes. Oh, I have to hit that. I have to make that tackle. I get the ball back with the avalanche. It's been a while since I've seen someone who really sticks to the run game. Doesn't need to here. Makes a nice pass. He's three for three. So it is a pass. Checks down low. Damn, he fought. Holy shit. Third and inches. He's probably going to QB sneak this. Wow. Fourth and inches. He whiffed the pass. We got bodies up here. Fourth and inches. <laughs> Oh my god, we stuffed him! Let's go! Holy shit, that's huge. Now we gotta get now we gotta climb the fucking ball out of here though. What a scary spot to be in. First and ten. Huge. Not it that holy shit, Dre Archer. I can suck you off. Let's go! That's disgusting. Let's go. I can't believe I didn't see a tush push, dude. I mean he knows what I'm doing, but we're doing anyway. Hell yeah. Great blocks, gentlemen. Second and six. Ray Lewis is subbed in at my third string tight end. I'm gonna go Dre Archer. Beauty. Dude, fucking, I love you, Dre Archer. I don't know about my challenge view, though. 31 plus points. I'm not looking like that guy right now. There's Gronk. Just over his head. Oh, he knew I was joking. Still got stiff armed. Let's go. You know what's interesting? Cover that. Ooh. Step up, CJ. Here we go, boys. 
stuffed him on the goal line, mounted a 99-yard drive, and we score our touchdown with 14 seconds on the clock. This half isn't over. If we can keep this tied up, this will be great because we get the ball after this. Dude, why am I getting sliced? I'm just getting dotted by the ruck. Ah, two corner rounds. That's fine. He stepped out of bounds, but I don't know how I didn't pick that. Doesn't matter too much. If I got the pick, though, I'd get momentum. Also, dude, I almost could have, I could have housed that bitch, huh? Oh my god, bro. This is actually you. I can't believe I'm in a game with you. Let's bring this out. We haven't used this yet at all. RPO zone alert bubble. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's supposed to be the... Why did it not let me pass that? Please let me throw it. What the fuck? Oh my god, it's so late. It was like a year late. And did they nerf RPOs? Or my ass? What was that? Oh my god, zone? Holy shit, that's the first time he ran that. Yeah, now he's back in man coverage, and he'll probably shade the outside there. If we just get some time, CD Lamb is gonna clear underneath. Oh my god, Dre Archer! No, don't juke, don't juke! Yup! 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 He played the joke! He tried to sit on the joke! I'm in your head! I'm in your walls! Oh my god! Holy shit! He was beating me 7 to 0, and he was about to score again. Go, Matt. Ooh! You're so close to the line! He's got that corner out, but he's not gonna throw it. What are you gonna throw? Oh, Aaron Donald! Third and 14, silver. Why am I calling him silver? 85 overall, Aaron Donald gets home. Gotta get off this. Get home, Jesse Bates! Let's go! Good defense! Dude, L. He's scared! No way, Hester. Go! Oh, Devin Hester! Oh! Dude, that's the longest punt return I've ever gotten to. This is a wild game. All right, that's our goat, Dree Archer. Archer. Yes. Dree? Dree Archer, dude, is an absolute savage. Oh, great block. Get inside. And he's got the stiff arm animation. If this is zone, we hit Jamar Chase. If it's man, we hit the whip route. Whip route. Wait. Say flowers. He's free. Have my children. Certain inches. Do I go? Do I go tushy pushy? I don't know if you can stop tush push with this formation he's in. Oh my God! What a block from Froholt. Hjalte Froholt, my 82 center, just chopped his ankles. Look at that fucking dude. What a savage. Fuck out his clock. I feel like I'm oh, cut this up. Middle, middle, middle. Go! Oh! Oh! I gotta stop juking before I fumble. What a fucking. I want to see him stop I form slot hat back blast before I switch out of it. I might, dude, I need a sub girl can a fullback. Let's play this smart here. I form slot. Fred Taylor is not going to be our lead blocker and neither should Vernon Davis. Let's take Gronk out for Vernon Davis so we can still throw. We'll put Gronk in an I form slot and then let's switch up our audibles. So now that I have my audible set, I can audible the stretch and he thinks I'm going up the middle. <gasps> oh, I think Zay Flowers could be a touchdown, but I don't know if I want to risk that. What a swat! Holy shit, that was a monster play from 52. Dree Archer was butt naked on the check down. Zay. No! Oh, he got it! No, he didn't. Oh, I don't know how CJ Stroud didn't get perfect accuracy there. Oh, I really had that. I freeformed inside. He had the step on him. It would have been a tough catch either way, but I'm really shocked that he didn't even animate for that ball. Used a ton of clock and got the two possession lead. That's really cool. He wants a corner route random boss. Oh, no. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Slay! Good knockout! She mounts on KO! No, he's got the post. Fuck, he got I should have got Good tackle. Oh! A little RPO over to Heinz Ward. Good juke. I can't burn the timeout, but that is not right. He's going corner out, corner out, corner out. Oh, good defense. Good defense, Demario. Second to six, he dies out of bounds. I don't. Does the clock stop here? Get home! Third and 18, Ray Lewis. I user Jalen Ramsey on Randy Moss. That was very scary. It worked out. Now we disguise the blitz. He thinks it's the blitz. It's not. Yup. 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 He doesn't know what to do. Oh. Fourth and 18. This is the ball game. We stop him here. You bitch made boy. Baker the goat bitch made boy. If I get the field goal, this is over. Fumble! Dude, I literally said I gotta stop juking with Jerry Archer. He's gonna fumble. There he goes. There he goes. Cuts it up the middle. Come on! Same hit, and that's a user hit. You gotta give me the fumble. His CPU Ray Lewis forced that. I got Avalanche again for that, though. There he is. Oh. You got... He didn't even get the down. Yeah, he did. That should have been a fumble. I rocked his shit with Avalanche. Does he run this? Is he trying to chew the clock? Score no time? Second and 11. That was a bad play. Ball game! Same thing he threw last.
last time and that time we're sitting on it. I'm going right back to I-form slot, but this time, ball carrier conservative, not making the same mistake twice. Smoke him! Let's go! Don't press Zay Flowers! Third and 12, final kneel, no timeouts left, insane. Oh no, he's not, he's actually being a dick. <laughs> he's griefing me is what he's doing. Cause he's a sore loser is he what he is. Quit, so he, he does, he's not gonna let it get to the end screen. I don't get to see my shit. Oh yes, yes, yes. Never mind. he's being cool, he's being cool. Thank you, Jaker. No challenge wheel, no dice on the 31 plus, but an insanely clutch defensive game takes us to the playoffs. Holy shit, that game was nuts. Look at the stats on this game. CJ Stroud, excellent game. He missed the one throw to Zay Flowers, which should have iced it earlier, but it's not a big deal because we iced it anyway with the, the, the second throw to Zay Flowers. Pastronaut was okay, started out hot, but he threw one incredibly crucial interception. And um, Dre, I think Dre Archer was the MVP. Ah, can I say that though? He fumbled. He fumbled, but Dre Archer was insane through the air. He's making tough catches, and um, the the chess match of not juking was insane there to get that touchdown. Dre Archer, 6 for 132 and a touchdown. 90 rack yards. And then Zay Flowers, super big catch. And um, Jamar Chase in his debut, he had one single whip route for 13 yards. I'm sorry I couldn't get him the ball more, but that dude was playing really good defense. All right, boys. Absolutely massive, massive, monumental W. We move to the playoffs. I hope you guys enjoyed this Wheel of Mud. I knew it'd be a banger. It's on the day of the Super Bowl. And, of course, enjoy the Super Bowl. Have a great day, gentlemen. I love you, boys. Talk soon. Peace.